What's up everybody? It's Vanessa. You're watching the Zilla Villa and August and I have some very exciting things to share and show you guys today. It kind of happened unexpectedly. It's something we've talked about a ton and it is an animal that we already have, but today is very exciting. We have some new additions. So without further ado, this is Chili. He is our male gargoyle gecko. And this is Honey. So we literally just picked these guys up. Uh, they're gonna be beautiful breeders for us. We also have a smaller one. We just, we got a baby. The baby is the original one for us. That one is named Bumble. I will upload a video of Bumble soon. But yeah, we're gonna show you their setup that we're doing. We are making them a quarantine setup for now. These two are gonna be ready to breed for us this year. So we're extremely excited. We got them from someone who was trying to rehome them and they got them from a very reputable breeder in our area. So we're not worried about that at all. What's our first step, August? So basically the first step is just to drill some vent holes into our Rubbermaid containers, which are going to be their enclosures. Um, it's going to be their quarantine enclosures uh, for the time being. All right. So what we're going to do for ventilation is I have some of these uh, three inch diameter sink strainer things. So we have our big Rubbermaids here. So this is just my drill with a two inch hole saw and an arbor and a pilot bit. I don't know how to explain it better than that. <laughs> We're gonna have to vacuum in here after this, basically. <laughs> So basically what had happened was my initial plan was to use the big hole saw, cut away the center hole, and then use a knife to shave away the edges to get the diameter necessary for the screen to fit into. But in using the knife to cut away some of the material, it cracked very badly. So I just had to go around with a smaller drill bit and drill holes around the diameter that I wanted the screen to fit into and then go with the knife again and cut away the tiny bits of material in between the holes. Uh, that's why there was so much drilling. I'm completely rethinking what I'm gonna do for this and realizing that my previous desired method is just not gonna work, so we're gonna use wire and just tie this on here. <laughs> What I'm doing now is just drilling eight holes on the end opposite from the screen, and then I'm gonna drill three holes on each side. Okay, so I have my scissors. I have some yogurt containers. I'm just gonna cut some holes into them just to make them some extra hides. So, pretty easy. Well, August um, is making the second enclosure. So pretty, you know, just as simple, simple for them to go into if they need to. This is not meant to look pretty, but here's our hides. Easy, quick, simple. Next, paper towel, this is a substrate right here. We're using paper towel for the substrate, putting in some fake plants and a vine for now in case they want something to climb on. Now, I'll show you what it looks like again. Not, not beautiful, really not that pretty. Obviously we have our food dish that we have to add in. I'm gonna mist this down and I'll show you what the other enclosure looks like once that one's ready and then we'll put these guys in. Haha, -ha, prank. I'm not gonna show you what the second one looks like because I was a silly goose and didn't film it. We are about to meet Chili for the first time. Here we go. Do you wanna take the lid off of Chili? Should I miss the 
a little closer first. Maybe a little bit. Yeah. That's a very important key. So while August misses it, oh, so here, he's here, a here, big boy. Out of the way so I don't spray him directly. Yeah. So here is Chili. Big boy. He's very handsome. Come on, buddy. I don't want to scoop him. If he's skittish. Come on, buddy. wants to be on the napkin and not on me. Let's see him. There he is. Wow. He's so handsome. There he is. That's chilly, everyone. Extremely good looking lizard. Wow. And this is him fired down. Handsome. Even when he's fired up, he looks completely different. So we'll, um, we'll let him settle in. Very beautiful boy. Very handsome boy. How you doing, buddy? Do they really grip? They really do. The the babies, we have a baby, and uh, it kind of slides off of you. <laughs> this guy, I can I can tilt my hand and he stays like he's on there. <laughs> All right. Well, let's put him in. Come on, bud. Come here, friend. Come here, buddy. There, oh, there go. he goes. So that's Chili. That's Chili. Next oh my goodness. Up, our female. This is her. Look at her. She's beautiful. Hi, baby. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> there she is. There's Honey. Oh my goodness. This is her. Wow. She's beautiful. She's gorgeous. This is her. Absolutely stunning. She just came right out on her own. She's very bold. She is She's big. beautiful. She's a very big girl. She's stunning. Oh my goodness, sweetheart. Do you want to come in? Go down here. Come yeah, on, baby. Go down. Well, she's licking the water drops <laughs> off the bamboo there. There you go. Oh, <laughs> and she just kind of fell. <laughs> wow. She is slippery. It is slippery. Bamboo's slippery. So tomorrow we're gonna get them some cork bark to make it a lot easier for them to climb around because we didn't really have any today. But um, wow, she's big. She's gorgeous. Cork bark and more of these vines. These yeah. vines are really stiff and good. So, but that's just, we just wanted to give them some space tonight. So that's what we did. I'm very excited to see what these two bring to the table for us this year. Uh, it's gonna be fun. Wow, but she's bold, she was ready to come out and she just did, yeah. So, I mean, they've been in there for an hour and a half, two hours maybe, while we uh, were driving home. Wasn't too, too long, but long enough. So we're gonna let them settle in tonight. And yeah, so thanks for watching everybody. Thank you. I'm Vanessa. I'm August. Get in the shot. <laughs> I'm August. <laughs> and you're watching the Zilla Villa. So please like, subscribe, dislike, comment, don't. It's a free country depending on where you live. But stay <laughs> tuned to our channel. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you next time. Yay! August is creeping behind the window. As you can see, he has just come back from letting out our dog. <laughs> See, that's strong. That's stronger than what I was gonna do. <laughs>